Hello everyone, welcome back to my crafty life. Um, I am back with another small haul. Um, this one is from Amazon. I was kind of a little enchanted by watching Tim Holtz. Um, it was a Halloween, -a, Halloween um, hoopla, one and two, so he was doing some demonstrating and he was having fun, so it made me want to go in and have fun. So I did buy a couple of things and I think it was on Amazon, there's a Sizzix store and they were having like, you buy three for like 30 bucks or 29 bucks or something like that. Anyways, so I thought it was kind of a good deal in a way. Um, so the first of the three by three um, were these mica stains. And with the mica stains, these are the Halloween from 2022, you get the grit paste. And so this is what, the three ounces of grit paste, which is, that's a pretty good chunk of product there. So I thought that was pretty cool. I'm dying, I was dying to play with this. I'm glad I got it. Um, I'm also, I was also dying to get a hold of this mica stain, which I believe is the harvest moon. And then you get burning ember and then iron gate, which, that looks great and this just just delicious colors and this one kind of busted out of its package but this is the other halloween from 2022 the fortune teller wicked elixir and decayed so those are really pretty colors so i'm looking forward to playing with that and so and then they had another similar one but it was the a holiday christmasy colored one so of course, you got your mica stains, and then you got your grit paste, but it was in the snowfall. So, I haven't necessarily seen demonstrations of the snowfall yet. However, of course I will, and see what kind of madness we can do for our next three-on-three. Three. So, I'm super excited about this. I'm starting to get heavily into, like, mixed-media messiness. Just, um, see what happens. Create messes and have fun. Um... So with these mica stains, this one came with Merry Mint, Cocktail Party, and a Shiny Bobble. Which of those are pretty Christmassy colors or spring colors, to be honest. Um, this one is a Fresh Balms Tart Cranberry and Winter Frost. And that Tart Cranberry looks almost like it needs to be in Halloween too. So that looks, it looks copper on the screen, but it's like a nice red. So that could be like a crime scene waiting to happen. So I'm excited for that. So there's that. Um, I did pick up a couple of dyes. One die, or well, the two. Two of the dyes are from the KS Craft Store. I have never purchased them before. I have seen some of her releases and they look great. I just never had, just never popped up. But this came up and I couldn't resist because I thought that was just super super cute background um whimsy stamps i know has a circle background die like similar to this in a way which is on, in my cart waiting but i wanted the heart ones too to for scrapbooking or even for cards i thought, thought that was really pretty and it's a good size um we're seeing length so we're looking at um, way over seven and a quarter. And then we're looking at about, mm, about three inches. So that's a good slim line card. So I got that. And then I have been looking all over for a die. And I know Tim Holtz has one, but it's, it's cute, but it's not necessarily the one I was looking for. But this one from KS Craft was pretty similar to what I had in mind. So I picked it up and had to ooh and ah over this. Ugh, these packages. I wanted a cauldron. I'm like, how can you not have a cauldron die? And I really wanted like a layering kind of cauldron die, but I just couldn't find one. But 
Like I wanted the smoke, I wanted the bubbles, the broomstick, I love. The little fish bones is adorable. Um, you can even make a shaker card out of this. I don't necessarily know if I'll make a shaker card, but I mean, I can put the insert back in and just create with it. But anyways, I was super excited about that. Uh, what is that one called? It's called Halloweening. Halloweening, I guess. I don't know if you can see that. Sorry. <laughs> but yeah, it's, it's super cute. It looks like final play with. And of course, the last thing I got was these guys. I am so in love with these guys. I don't know why I didn't get them sooner. Sorry for the glare. But um, I want to say this is uh, the 2021 release of the Thin Let's Color It's, but I just, I just don't know why. They're just so cute. Adorable. I mean, how can you not with a creepy background? It's going to be awesome. So yeah, that's what I got. I am so looking forward to getting a little messy. So we'll see what comes about. Um, so thank you so much for stopping by and I hope you have a fabulous day. Bye.